Hi everyone, it's me, Benny. Um, just want to update you all on our fundraising efforts, as well as my first competition. As most of you already know, I signed up for my first ever Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu tournament, which will be going down tomorrow. I am not nervous at all, I promise, I promise, I promise. Just kidding, maybe a little bit. But, um, so with my first ever tournament slash competition, I decided that with my great network of friends and family, I would put those relationships to good use and start a fundraiser. And that's where Tap Cancer Out comes in. Tap Cancer Out is a jujitsu based nonprofit organization that's raising awareness and funds for cancer fighting organizations on behalf of the grappling community, including Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. <clears throat> this year, their beneficiary is St. Baldrick's Foundation. FYI, don't try to Google St. Baldrick expecting the name of a real saint to come up. It is actually just a play on words. St. Baldrick started out between three friends. They were, figuring out, they were figuring out a way to give back to the community in some sort of fashion. So... They decided that they would shave their heads to show solidarity with the youth who are fighting the battle against cancer in a fundraising type event. And their actual first fundraising event with head shaving happened on St. Patrick's Day. And you put the two together and that's where St. Baldrick's came in. Yeah. So, um, actually, there was a super coincidence. I went to a barber shop this morning, and you know those aprons that they put on you so that you don't get hair all over yourself? Their aprons were actually from St. Baldrick's. So, that, I kind of took that as a sign, and I figured instead of my normal haircut, I would go ahead and shave my head as well in in solidarity with what the people at St. Baldrick's do. So this is for you guys. Anyway, um, so that's that. That's a little history about St. Baldrick's and how they became and what they're all about. <clears throat> As of our fundraising event, right now we are at $652. Woohoo, good job everybody. Because my original goal, when I first said it, was only 250 bucks, And we blew through that in like 0 to 100 real quick. No drink. Um, so yeah, I want to thank everybody for your contributions, for all the shares, all the likes on my social media posts. For putting up with my, uh, I don't know, whatever with all my extra pushing in social media or whatever. But thank you all. Um, we definitely wouldn't have gotten this far without all your help. Today is actually the self-imposed deadline that I put for this fundraiser. And even though we didn't reach the new goal of 750, um, I think we did pretty all right for ourselves. So I applaud you all. Thank you, thank you, thank you. With that said, it is still November 1st, so there is still some time. So if you would kindly and are able to, please continue to share, continue to spread the word, continue to like my posts, and continue to contribute if you can. And I'd really appreciate it, and that would be absolutely beautiful. And thank you. Um, so as far as my competition tomorrow is concerned, I'm about as ready as I'm ever going to be right now. I don't think I'm going to get any better overnight. Unless, no, there's no unless. I'm not going to get any better overnight. But I am super confident. I am absolutely sure that I will put 100% out on the mat. Whether that's enough to get a win, can't tell you, but... I'm, I'm going to give it what I have. 
Um, I do have one trick up my sleeve, though. Um, so I have a couple of patches, right? And I'm going to throw them on my gi. My theory is that my opponent is going to see these patches and he's going to think, wow, this guy has a lot of patches. He must be sponsored. If he's sponsored, then that means he must be really good. Um, yeah, so with that mentally defeated, I will take that and we'll see how that turns out. Now, this theory hasn't been proven, so I'll let you know how that goes. Um, as far as the patches, these are two of them that I want to put on. This is from Tap Cancer Out. I'm going to put one on each gi that I'm bringing tomorrow to the competition. And then the other two are from a good friend of mine. And uh, he also contributed to our effort, so thank you. A couple of Eat Sleep Brace patches. How's that? Go check them out at sleepbrace.com. Um, they also do a lot of a lot of things with their with their gear to help out in the local community as well. So they're they're a bunch of good people. Check them out if you have the chance. <clears throat> thank you again, Eat Sleep Brace. Um, again, I want to thank everyone for your support and all your help. Just want to remind you all we are doing this in memory of me, Ma, Mama Reyes, Mama Delcy, our boy Blue. Miriam Torres, Guillermo Marquez, Yen Tran and John Tran, Mary LaVilla, Rosalinda Ventigan, Connie and Christine, and to all those that are still fighting. This is for you guys. And that's it. Thank you all for listening. I'm out. Peace.